Hello everyone, in this video we are going to write a custom Java annotation uh, for measuring the execution time of the method. For that purpose I already write one API that will have a randomly delayed response. I started the app, let's see how this is working. So uh, you can see the response is 4 seconds, 5 milliseconds, 1 second. So basically, uh, we have a randomly delaying of the response. So let's start writing our annotation for measuring the execution time. So first thing that we're going to do is to create a package with me annotation and uh, let's create our annotation let's name it mm, like measure execution time uh, like this we need to add like two annotation here one uh, first annotation is the retention. It should be with the retention policy uh, runtime. And our target, our target will be, we want to use it on the methods. So we, uh, in this step, we defined uh, the annotation. Now uh, let's implement it. So let's name it like measure execution time aspect and let's expose this as a component put a logger and add this aspect annotation basically this is uh, what we are going to use so let's add it as a dependency so we can import the aspect will be around our defined annotation so let's type it annotation and put uh, the path so com dot example dot time measure annotation measure execution time measure time uh, we then need to, to add a proceed join point and basically we have defined this uh, um, method so this is how we are executing the method so what we need to do here What we are going to do is to measure the execution of this part. So for this purpose, what we are going to do is I will use stopwatch. Stopwatch. I will start it before the execution and I will stop it after execution. And let's lock the response so what we will type here so method is executing let's see how many seconds so we have the name of the method and the execution time in mill 
Okay, so uh, let's see what we, we, we did. So we have a defined annotation and we have implement, basically what is happening on that annotation. Uh, when we are going to add, so uh, we are executing the method. And before we are starting the uh, stopwatch and after that we are stopping and just logging the name of the method and total time needed to be executed in milliseconds. Let's put our annotation on the API. So we can run it, the app. Let's clean the lock and uh, send a couple of requests. So again, the response is randomly delayed. And let's see what we have in our log. As you can see, we have how much milliseconds are needed to be executed this method. Thank you for watching the video. See you soon. Bye.